from multi-million dollar guest house to nothing more than an unstable shell. Last night, John Singleton took one of the worst possible calls. He said, well, mate, I don't know how to tell you, but the whole place is gone. The fire started inside the main building and the secluded retreat went up in smoke just weeks after it came under threat from a bushfire. It's hard to imagine that it could have survived that. How could it possibly happen? It wasn't a complete wipeout. Three guest pavilions, where you can stay for around $2,000 a night, were saved. But it was touch and go. One of the biggest issues facing crews fighting this fire was getting a water supply from hydrants here at street level up the 300 metre steep hill to the property. It took a convoy of trucks to pump it up, but even then, crews were forced to rely on water from the pool to fight the fire. The property was close to Singleton's heart, his daughter Jessie, due to be married there in six weeks' time. She'd be sitting in Monte Carlo feeling that she's not Princess Grace after all.